Let's figure out which fraction is greater, one half or five sevenths. Here's how we do that. We need to find a common denominator, something that two and seven will both go into evenly. We have a common denominator. We can just compare the numerators, figure out whether one half is greater than five sevenths or five sevenths is greater than one half. So let's do this. Let's multiply two times seven. Two times seven equals 14. And then down here, let's multiply seven times two. Seven times two, that equals 14 as well. So we have our common denominator, but we can't just multiply two by seven. We also need to multiply the numerator by seven as well. Seven divided by seven, that's just one. So we don't change the value. We just change the way that it's represented here. One times seven is seven. And seven divided by 14 or one divided by two, they both give you the decimal 0 0.5. They're equivalent fractions. Down here, let's multiply five by two as well, just like we did the denominator. Five times two is 10. And now we have two fractions. Their denominators are the same. So we can just compare the numerators. When we do that, since 10 is larger than seven, 10 fourteenths is larger than seven fourteenths. Likewise, that means five sevenths, that's gonna be greater than one half. So in answer to our question, when we compare one half and five sevenths, the greater fraction is five sevenths. This is Dr. B and thanks for watching.